BBC Tees. Right now, though, at 6.30, it's time for your latest news headlines with Graham Pickering. The fate of thousands of British jobs at Tata Steel, which has sites in Hartlepool and East Cleveland, could be decided later when the board of the Indian steel firm meets in Mumbai. Tata announced in January it was shedding more than a 1,000 jobs in the UK, with the Port Talbot plant in South Wales bearing the brunt. A nine-year-old Middlesbrough boy is enjoying greater independence thanks to a brand-new electric wheelchair. Kenzie Hughes was without the use of his legs and speech and only limited movement in his arms due to cerebral palsy. A mobile phone app for motorcyclists developed by a North East company has become the first in the UK to be officially approved by the emergency services. Real Rider works by sending a rider's last known location via GPS to the nearest ambulance service.